Okay, so just jumping into this video real quickly, um, YouTube viewers. This client came in with her hair was um, half permed. And I think everybody who knows me know that I am like the perm girl that fixes it up. So what we're doing, is her if you notice, her ends are kind of like on the frizzy, bushy side because um, her perm didn't do as well when she had it done previously, not from me, but somewhere else. So what I did so far, what you guys didn't see, is I applied the relaxer away from the roots, like from about here up to this point. And notice those ends are still in the natural. That's because we'll do them later. So then I came back with the relaxer product and I put it on the, the new growth and brought it up to this point. So now what I'm doing now is I'm bringing everything together. If you notice what I'm doing back here, I'm bringing everything together from that root area all the way down to those ends now. Always remember, if you're doing ends and you have to pull something through, do the ends last because the ends are more porous. And you end up clipping them anyway, but the point is you don't want to break them off any sooner. So you want to work with them a little slower. So this product now, what we're doing is we're working it on and we're bringing it down to the ends because the ends are going to already smooth out. And we're going to hope that this works for her this time around. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through her entire head. I'm going to get this product through. See how it come up here and I'm combing it comes to a knot. Just work that out just gently. You don't want to break nothing off because hair is like a rubber band. The more you pull a rubber band, what happens? It pops. Hair does the same thing. So we're going to just work this out in the root, get the root smooth. And then we're going to pull down like that on the end. Just smooth it out with the back of your comb. No, no combing, no tugging. Okay? So we're going to do this throughout. We're going to show you guys how this turns out in the end. All right? So we'll be back shortly. What, what I have done is I took that relax and I pulled it all the way through as I showed you earlier. And I'm bringing it right to those very, very ends. If you guys are familiar with my poodle perm videos, this is something like I'm doing here, but on shorter hair. So see, I'm just working it on those ends. I'm not combing it. I'm not doing anything. I'm just smoothing it with my hands. So I'm going to do is rinse her out and we'll be back. Okay, so this is the rinse out. And if you notice, she's a lot smoother, but you have not, you did not see what she looked like before. She was a lot crinklier. She had a lot of um, new growth up and through here. So what we did is we just made sure this was smooth. Most, most of this hair here was really crinkly. So we got that smooth too. So what we're going to do now, we're going to put some color on here. She wants to have some kind of burgundy color. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to put some burgundy color in here. And um, what I like to use is, um, it's a, uh, it's called burgundy brown because she wants to be dark and you just squeeze it out of the tube really see there and you can take and comb that in and it does stain your scalp so you got to be real careful so and get it and just comb it out so I'm going to get this throughout her whole head and we're going to show you what it looks like in the end the whole everything okay okay so I got all the color through her hair if you notice it was already one color with mostly gray so now we put like a deep burgundy brown on there. So we're gonna let this take its course, run for 20 minutes and we'll be back. Okay, so what I did was I gave her like a wrap after I rinsed out her color and I just wrapped her to tie these up. These are like neck strips. It's nice and stretchy. Black ones are a little harder, a little stronger than the white ones. So I like these a little better. And I just wrapped it up and I'm gonna put it into dryer for a little bit so it's gonna dry just like that. And then we're gonna comb around and style and then you'll get to see the finish. Okay, so this is our finish. As you notice, we tapered the back and we gave her the color. So if you notice, we'll turn her around and you can see the front and see the little highlights in there in the style. Isn't that beautiful? Yep, and as we continue to turn around, you will see the sides and we tapered it all up. So this is our finish. Okay, if you like this video, subscribe and give us a thumbs up. Thanks for watching, Fern from the House of Glamour.